So the idea behind the emergency grant was to provide short-term support to students so that they could focus on their studies and not have to drop out of school and not fulfill their goals. COVID was kind of tough for everybody, but I kind of checked all the boxes. And in addition to having to work from home, I was also virtual schooling my eight going on nine year old. And that wasn't working really well at the beginning. I had a professor, I think that kind of said, hey, um, there's an emergency grant. If anybody needs it, you guys should um, apply for it. And then and when I took the leave, it allowed me to work 20 hours and then the other hours throughout the week, I would be able to help my daughter along with her schoolwork. I've been going to CUNY for a very long time and I'm grateful for the opportunity that I have because I went to CUNY. Tuition has always been relatively inexpensive. When I was in that program, that was my third degree. And that was probably the only time that I really like did not have the funds that I needed um, just in general. So getting that and being able to pay my bills allowed me to continue in the program because sometimes you have to make a choice between your needs and your wants. And as much as your education is a need, I'm not gonna put that before, you know, feeding my child or making sure that we have shelter. So getting those funds allowed me to still provide in a way that I was supposed to and then I could still concentrate to be able to finish the program. And I did really well. I think my GPA was like a 3.9 or something in that semester or 4.0, I don't remember. But when you get that opportunity and you can focus on school, it's not as stressful. So that's why I was grateful to receive it. So the one thing I will say about the emergency grant that we really strive to reinforce is that this is a judgment-free zone. If you have a genuine financial need and really need that short-term assistance to help you just deal with the next few months, deal with school, that is a student that we encourage to apply. Um, one that can genuinely demonstrate a financial need, but understanding that we are not judging the situation that you're in. Understanding life happens. At the time of COVID, because I was an independent contractor, I literally lost all of that work at once. It, there was nothing that really persisted. So I found myself in a little bit of a situation and luckily with SPS, it was virtual. So that wasn't an issue, but I was just trying to figure out what would keep me in New York because I was due to graduate within months of that time. I had planned on starting my career in New York. And I just happened to receive an email um, from SPS kind of talking about the grant and not thinking that, cause I knew that so many people were in my position. Um, and so I was like, oh, there's no way that I will be eligible, but I might as well apply, you know, and they've helped me in the past. I hate accepting that I need help sometimes, but I really kind of tried to become internal and think about, you know, I am in a situation and, and this is gonna kind of determine whether I can stay in the city or not. Even, even just like a month of help gives me a month of time to figure out what I'm gonna do. So when I applied for the grant, I think within a couple of weeks I received a response from them and I was just completely elated and they covered my, my rent for a month as well as my utilities for a month, um, which was amazing. And then because of that, it gave me the time. I was able to stay in New York, I graduated like via Zoom, and then I able, was able to get this job. So it was kind of like one little thing. Otherwise, I probably would have left New York, you know what I mean? So it, it's amazing actually how much it ended up helping, just like something, a small assistance and being willing to ask for help, so yeah. It's been very impactful uh, for both my team and the student. It's motivating seeing our students push through their obstacle. From the student's perspective, they're so appreciative that someone is looking at them as a person and not judging them and knowing, okay, SPS has my back. I can finish this. There's at least a resource. Um, it may not solve all their problems, but at least in that moment, it's one less thing that they have to worry about.